I will be 25 on Friday. Since I was 19, I've been on probation. Um, and uh, in the last year, I've been in jail twice. And it took this last time in jail to, I think, really get me ready for recovery. I had a hard time in jail because I'm a spoiled brat. And um, I, I had um, some medical issues. I have seizures and they weren't taking care of me properly. And when I did have a seizure, instead of taking me to medical and getting my information from my doctors, they just threw me in the hole like I was in trouble. I guess something just came over me after I'd been there for about a month and a half and I decided that enough was enough and um, it, it was time. I uh, found out that I had hepatitis C. Um, but I didn't have to use it over it, you know, like, there was more than that that went on last week, but being in jail and then getting out of jail and finding out that you have hepatitis C is very inspirational not to use, because I pretty much can't use. Um, I mean, I'm gonna die if I use and I'm gonna go back to jail because I'm still on probation. <laughs> but I mean, this last trip, I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't want to use anymore. It's not, it's, it's really not fun anymore. Since I've gotten out of jail, um, you know, I've been doing everything differently than I've done it before. I never wanted to take suggestions unless they were suggestions that I wanted to take. Um, I mean, I, I'm not going to say that I'm being perfect because I'm using shopping as my drug right now. Um, but, you know, I'm, I got a sponsor as soon as I got out of jail. I went from jail to a meeting and got my sponsor at that meeting. I have a home group and I'm chairing the meetings of that home group right now. Um, I'm on the subcommittee for the convention. Um, I already have a job, um, and I haven't been out of jail quite two weeks yet, so I can totally see where the program works and you get your life back if you really try. Um, so that's basically my story. I just have to keep going in the right direction.